So hey, what's going on everyone, Kid here, and today we're talking about Glyphnir Chapter 55. It was released last week and we got a butt ton of information uh, with regards to the manga. So I think this was a translation error, but it said the anime is being reissued. I couldn't find a lot of info on that, but um, Volume 8 sales are doing really well, that's good news to hear. Usually when a manga is selling really well, they'll green light it for another season. Now, that doesn't mean there will be a second season. It's just uh, that helps. We also got some insight into Shiichi's lost memories via a Shiichi and a Yoshioka fusion. The pink hair cowhouse returns. Now all we gotta hope is that Anoka doesn't get wind of this trip down the memory lane. Speaking of that very same trip, we finally got to see how Kaido brought back Anoka. And uh, let me tell you, it's not pretty. Um, <laughs> Kaido, in his infinite wisdom, could not handle the crime of killing Anoka. Because Hanoka didn't kill Aiko. She just slipped in when Aiko committed suicide because she couldn't handle being bullied. We know that from the previous chapters. So again, Kaido, in his infinite wisdom, went to the alien. And I'm really starting to not like this alien the more information I get about him. The alien agreed to help Kaido, but there was a catch to his help. There's always a catch. For the one time price of a hundred coins, he revived the person. Nothing could go wrong with this. So, yeah, he helped him for the one time price of a hundred coins. Kaido still had a problem, though. Hanoka was cremated because she still looked like Aiko, and they thought she was dead. So, you can't really revive a person without a body. And here, here, here comes the kicker. Since Kaido needed a new body to revive Anoka, he did what any logical person would do. No, he didn't off himself, which is the sound and logical thing to do when you commit an unthinkable crime that you can't be punished for. No, he did what any psychopath would do. He kept killing. He killed his parents and an entire town of people just to give birth to an abomination that he calls Hanoka. Hanoka, the new agonination, which is not really Hanoka, but we'll get to that, hates the world because, well, she's an agonization that doesn't belong in it. Hanoka doesn't have a soul. She's just an empty shell that's searching for, well, the memories and any information that can show her what she was like when she was alive. While that there are people who can tell her that that won't satisfy this monster. The problem is the monster can't be satisfied because the thing it's looking for is its soul which is already passed on. And since those answers don't exist, she's just freaking erasing people for a problem that they can't fix. My whole problem with this situation, I don't blame Kaido. Yeah, sure, he's a fuck, but I'm really starting to think this alien is more of a problem than Kaido or Hanoka could ever be. I mean, what the hell, dude? Wasn't this girl your first friend? I know you're mad about this, and you, you you should be. You should be mad at Kaido. Or... Another problem I have is 
that our alien friend isn't doing anything. I mean, technically, isn't Kaido put in a hole to the game? Because he's guarding the spaceship while all the, where the rest of the coin should be. So the game can't end. And he's just, instead of stalking Kaido, he's just, oh, they'll handle it. It'll solve itself eventually. Why hasn't he stepped in yet? Is he really that salty with the human race that he just doesn't care what happens? Or is he really that lazy that he can't be bothered to clean up his own mess? Because yes, Kaido killed Hanoka for no reason, but the alien is at fault because he's facilitated all of this bullshit. And that's my problem with the alien. Chapter, chapter 55 ends with Kaido asking Shaichi to put a stop to his madness. Um, and that's chapter 55. I don't know if I'll go back and review the other chapters, but if you like to see that, let me know. Um, as always, get subscribed for more content, videos every Monday. Leave a like if you like, leave a dislike if you didn't. And uh, yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye, bye.